Get down here, Merc. Coming with us. Nice and easy. I don't think so. Not bad. Who in the hell? Hands where I can see them. Have fun. Go ahead. Enough of this. Oh shit! He a soldier operator! That's that. Let's go. Drop the weapon! You got this. Yeah, what he said. You're coming with us. Can't get surrounded. So what soldier boy's deal? Is he one of us now? He's got balls, this, uh, uh, what was his name again? Cloud. Cloud Strife. Right. And he isn't a soldier anymore. Still, he's a professional, unlike the rest of us. I'm glad to have him. <laughs> this is a one-time gig. When it's done, we're done. Uh, uh, uh. Really enjoy the work with him. Real joy to look at, too. Here we go. Looks are what people notice first. Guess I'm not on the same page as people. I'd say you're not even reading the same book. No, I don't. Or even the same... Give it a rest. <sighs> Come on, nobody do something this crazy just for money. They may not think you're a true believer, but you know what I think? Not interested. What? Wedge. Uh... <sighs> you better be worth the money, Merc. Every last gill. like you're next. Was never in doubt.
way. Huh? <laughs> Not so fast. We've got company. This will be quick. That it? Soldiers may attack on command, but I hear they make good guard dogs, too. Bet you've seen a few reactors. So how do we get to the bridge above Mako storage? <sighs> Ain't holding out on me, are you? Stamp scared to bite the hand that fed him? Or is he a loyal little doggy? <clears throat> Have it your way, mutt. We can do this with you, or we can do this without you. Different reactor, different layout. Depends when it was built. Never seen one like this, but I'll manage. Don't you worry. Biggs will have the door open soon. I'm watching you. In three, two... Damn, I'm good. Who's there? Door! Well, wait! It's over! That's my line. He's alone! We can take him! That's Make that. it rain! someone who can get us the passcodes. <sighs> Pity no one else at command will talk to us, but what can you do? <sighs> then we're good. Careful in there. <clears throat> I got this place covered. Tifa, right? It's not really my business, but are you guys close? Tifa and I...
These sewer rats appear to call themselves Avalanche, sir. We are currently investigating whether they belong to the same group that made the attempt on your life. Rest assured, our inquiries will not take much longer. <laughs> this pump's sole purpose is to drain the planet dry. While you sleep, while you eat, while you shit, it's here sucking up, Marco! It doesn't rest, and it doesn't care! You do realize what Marco is, don't you? Marco <sighs> is the lifeblood of our world. The planet bleeds green like you and me bleed red! What the hell you think's gonna happen when it's all gone, huh? Answer me! You gonna stand there and pretend you can't hear the planet crying out in pain? I know you can! You really hear that? Damn straight I do! Get help. <laughs> Say that again! <laughs> I'd worry less about the planet and more about the next five seconds. Save the screaming for later. Our lives are on the line now. You listening, Merc? One false move. And that happens. Well, so much for having Cloud do all the fighting. There are some places a sword just can't reach. <laughs> just bear with him for me, would you? <sighs> yeah. Should have asked for more money. Sword at him? Let the man with the gun go to work. here a laser security system great those things will hurt more than your pride if you're careless they'll cut you down to size and then some but I'm guessing you've done this kind of thing before yeah figure out the timing of the lasers then make a move when they cycle off exactly I'll go first nothing like a little danger to get the blood pumping hey just keep those baby blues of yours on me Not too shabby. 
You're doing good, soldier. And it's more of the same. Come on, then. Sweepers for nothing. They can wipe out a whole squad in seconds. Not if you wipe the floor with them first. Ha! Ah! We can take this hunk of junk! That hunk of junk is a heavy weapons platform. If we rush in, we die. Is that right? We need to hit it with magic. That should give us an opening. Hey! It's not moving! Let's put it down. Give it all you've got. That's that. See ya. What is something? First. Soldier first class doesn't go into the 20s. What the hell are you talking about? I mean your age, not your goddamn rank. I, uh... <clears throat> Though for all I know, a soldier's rank could be the same as his age. Mm -hmm. Guess that make you a one-year-old, huh? Live and learn! That's our target, the reactor core. Gotta set the bomb at the bottom. Let's get down there. God damn. I can practically taste the bottom of this. Hurry it up. Ma, oh, it's pounding like a jacket. Scared, huh? <laughs> More like excited. I've been dreaming about this for years. Heads up, boys. The end's in sight. I leave the rest in your capable hands. Good luck. Not worth my time. Too bad. It's your job. <laughs> Deal with that. About damn time. Ain't no thing. Right down to the bottom. To the planet's core. No. <laughs> Nothing to it. Let's see if Little Stamp really can bite the hand that feeds. Hmm. Go on. Do the honors. Prove to me you're the man Tifa says you are. That you're one of us. Never said I was. I'm just here for the paycheck. Then do the damn job! Fine. What about the timer? Your call, Merc. Huh. That long enough for you? Oh. 
can be overloaded. Lightning magic. Huh. No other option, huh? Your brilliant plan, genius. <laughs> it's my time to shine. <laughs> or go down in flames. Time to fry. Damn it. Gotta do something about that barrier first. Yeah. If we don't change it up soon, this thing's gonna kill us both. Less talking, more shooting. How about less lift from you? <laughs> Damn it. This thing is tough! It wouldn't be much of a weapon if it went down easy. Don't compliment the giant scorpion! <laughs> Need a light. There! Attack it from the rear! Hi, right, soldier boy! Show me what you got! Alright. <laughs> Get ready. <laughs> Keep it together. All right, watch and learn. Damn pain in the ass. You got this. Hang back. Let's do this. Focus and find a way. Watch the tail. You don't want to be hit by that laser. Huh? So, what do we do? Don't get hit. Take cover behind that debris.
<laughs> you hear that? Damn thing showed you how it's done. Come on, we've got to move. Where should we be covering our way out? Go, go, go! Concentrate. Oh. Ah. 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 
Take that as a yes. Like we made it. And with nothing but a few scratches to show. <laughs> Think you might have overdone it? I followed the instructions to the letter. Maybe it triggered a reaction with the Mako? Well, let's hope the city's still in one piece. But the planet's what matters, right? <laughs> I mean, this must have helped some. After all that, it had better have. Anyway, let's get going. We in Sector 8? That'd be just down there. All right, then. Lead the way. You got it! Huh. Watch out for live wires. They're everywhere! Ugh. The air in here reeks. Can't wait to get out in the open. What is that? I've never smelled anything so foul. Oh, it's me. Gotta do something about that. And soon. I felt that one in my guts. They just keep on coming. We need to get out of this place. Was it the Mako density? The primary explosive? The blasting agent? Hey, we can figure that out later. <sighs> I'm running on empty here. You can refuel at the base. Next time I'll have to bring a little pick-me-up. How much farther do we have to go? Not far.
That's about as good a place as any. Stand back then. I'll set the bomb. Can't wait to see you, Marlene. Can't wait to take a hot shower. She's good to go. Fire in the hole! Told those doors. Let that be a Let's lesson to anything that gets in my way. Attention, all citizens. Attention, all citizens. This is an alert from the Shinra Emergency Operations Center. Unidentified intruders have detonated a bomb inside Mako Reactor 1. Multiple explosions have been confirmed, as well as ongoing fire. In response, a disaster warning has been issued in sectors 1 and 8. Structures in the area are at high risk of collapse, rendering the entire sector hazardous. Therefore, all residents of the No. No way. This couldn't have been us, could it? But what if it was? What's done is done. <laughs> Merck's right. It ain't pretty, but we can't stop now. This was just the first reactor, and the planet won't be safe till we get the rest. Yeah, we always knew this was gonna get messy. And this is only the beginning. Y'all gotta look at the bigger picture here. Nothing worth fighting for was ever won without sacrifice. Though you may not be crying out, I know you're in pain, just like the planet. But it's okay, cause I'm here for you, to help take the load off your shoulders. Your fears, your worries, your concerns, and yes, your fears. Whatever your problem, I got you. Huh? Hmm. So, what's our next move, boss? That's easy enough. We get our asses home! We'll split up and shoot for the last train home. Regroup in the freight car. Got it? Later then! Hey. I'd like my money now. You can have it. Once we're back at base. Yoo -hoo. I don't need to tell you what this is, right? Of course not. It's healing material. You can have it for saving my life. Just doing my job, nothing more. Yeah, yeah. Fact is, I'm lucky you were there. <clears throat> Survival can be a matter of luck or skill. And you can't rely on luck. Words to live by. <laughs> yeah, well, thanks. You do know how to use it, right? You do know what I was, right?
systems intact. You're not real. You're... dead. I am. Um... I killed you with my own... <gasps> oh, you need not remind me. It was the crowning moment of our time together. But that was then, and this is now. I have a favor to ask. Our beloved planet is dying. Slowly. Silently. Can you bear to see the planet suffer? Cloud. Were the planet to die, so many things would be lost. Your hometown burns so bright. The sound of her voice, pleading for me to spare you. The shiver of her flesh, yielding to cold steel. That which binds us together would be no more, and I would be loath to live in such a world, which is why I must ask you this one favor. Don't worry, it's a simple thing. Run, Cloud. Run away. You have to leave. You have to live. You bastard! Good, Cloud. Very good. Hold on to that hatred. I'm seeing things. Fumes from all the Mako, maybe. All right. You got this.
whoever did this. I could never hope to climb all that. There's no way we're getting through that mess. Let's just Too weak to save anyone. <laughs> Not even yourself. Are you okay? <sighs> hey, are you okay? I'm fine. Here, this is for you. Huh? A flower? That's right. It's a gift. You know, for scaring those things away. What things? Never mind. Think of it as a memento. Just my luck. I heard that, you know. How much? Well, that depends on the customer. In your case... <laughs> it's on the house. Huh? Lovers used to give these, when they were reunited. Look, I'm involved in things. Dangerous things. Oh, I'm sure you are. So? So keep your distance. Wait, you think someone's out to get you? Is that what you're all worked up about? Relax. No one's going to attack you. I promise. Hey, a Mako reactor just blew. You shouldn't be out here trying to self- Eyes on the 
go. Just give it up! Don't run! Sink him! Boxsmith, Boxsmith! You know where to run! Let's do this. Shoot to kill! Was 
never in doubt. Confirmed! Target has entered residential area! All lockdown is in effect! All units! Target! You're mine now! Target spotted! Moving to intercept! This cloud won't be joining us after all. No need to assume the worst. I'm sure he's fine. You saw him in action, didn't you? Guy's a soldier. Goddamn one-man army. Mm -hmm. You think he's a keeper? Giving public security the runaround? That's what. Had to draw them away from the station somehow. 
Nicely done. Well, can't argue with results, huh? <clears throat> what? <sighs> Wait. Got a question for you all. What? Ever been attacked by an invisible enemy? Uh, what? Mm -hmm. Wearing robes. Came and went like the wind. <laughs> Thought they were invisible. They were, at first. Only saw them after she grabbed me. A new Shinra weapon, maybe? <laughs> More like a panic-induced hallucination. <clears throat> Never mind. Forget I said anything. Suit yourself. Come on, let's move up. A lot of people here. And in the freight car, too. Because of the evacuation order, maybe? Lucky us. Station. We've got a crowd to hide. Head for the front of the train and hold there. At Mako Reactor 1. An emergency schedule is now in effect. Your understanding and cooperation is appreciated. No guards here, right? Wow, who would have thought there'd be people riding in the race? Are you the one who had to be 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 the one who had you're, uh, holding up pretty well, huh? Even after what we saw at the station and all over Sector 8? I'm a soldier. Well, my hands are still shaking. You get used to it. Something to look forward to. Or maybe not. Have they caught the perpetrators yet? You see, my daughter now lives in Why Sector 8, so... Why don't you learn to take so... a hint, buddy? Have they caught the perpetrators yet? Should have never gotten out of bed this morning. Just called in sick. Did Mr. Shinra catch the bad men yet? Little help, Cloud? Please? Don't be stupid. Yeah, the slums. What kind of maniacs would go so far as to bomb a reactor? <sighs> They've yet to announce it publicly, but I heard it was Avalanche's doing. Really? Aren't they the terrorists who tried to kill the president? Mm. Is there nothing they won't do? Hey, <gasps> quit talking no. out your ass. <gasps> Everyone knows Avalanche only cares about saving the planet. Hmm? J just who do you think you are? A law-abiding concerned citizen. <laughs> Law-abiding? Really? Mm. <laughs> uh, uh, shh! Don't antagonize him. In my humble opinion, that explosion was a message. A message to the bastards bleeding our planet dry. Think they got it? Heard it loud and clear? <laughs> Y'all's masters? <laughs> We will not submit to intimidation or violence, but work together for peace and prosperity. That is how civilized people change the world. That's right. That is the Shinra Creed. <laughs> Them fighting words. It's what we believe. We all have to follow our conscience, don't we? We should go. Right. <laughs> How much longer till this?
didn't hear anything. You gotta believe me. You hear that suit? Shinra creed my ass. <sighs> Let's get this out of the way. Personally, I find visual aids make the dull stuff a lot more bearable. If it helps, think of it as an initiation rite. How many times do I have to tell you people? I'm not... <clears throat> There's such a thing as playing too hard to get. So, here we've got a wireframe model of the great city of Midgar, complete with massive steel plates suspended 300 meters above ground level. Atop which stands a shining beacon of civilization. The whole system is sustained by the Mako reactors, which feed the insatiable appetites of the public. The train will be passing through an ID checkpoint shortly. This here is the train's route. As you can see, it'll take us around this main pillar. Look, we're about halfway through it now. They've set up a checkpoint here to scan the IDs of all passengers heading in and out. Date of birth, residential status, criminal history, all that and more is automatically cross-referenced in their databases. Public security wouldn't have it any other way. Heads up. <sighs> Don't worry, our IDs are impeccable. What'd I tell you? Have a little faith. Won't be long till we reach the bottom. Relax. Take a good look. It's because of that great big pizza in the sky that people down there gotta struggle to survive. Shinra sucks up Mako. While the soil turns to dust, the air fills with smog, and the flowers die. Then leave and don't look back. <sighs> that's what's always worked for me. <sighs> well, that's all well and good. If you're only out for yourself. But the folks down there don't have the luxury of choice, you know? One, members lost zero. And one step closer to a brighter future. Hell yeah! Guys! Lower your voices, huh? People are listening. Oh, God. Right. <laughs> ah. hm. Now get some r, r You've earned it. Just be ready for the next mission, all right? Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> See you soon. Uh, at Seventh Heaven. You know, where Tifa works. Don't keep her waiting, she'll worry. broken for now but don't you worry we're gonna fix it it'll be up and running in no time really that's great that's just that's enough sweetie. fried march a handful I'm just oh. i've never felt the ground like that dumb plays only had us <gasps> i've never seen anything like it before it was like a giant handle oh, lighting up the piled whole up like mountains you couldn't go nowhere Huh. Mako is the lifeblood of the planet? Yeah, the hell it is. Goddamn eco-warriors with their dumbass posters. 
I tear them down and they're back up inside of an hour. Like I've got nothing better to do. I mean, look at all that steelwork. You trying to tell me that's not progress? <laughs> <laughs> What the? You okay, buddy? <sighs> Mako Junkie, huh? Figures. You again. That hot shower can't come soon enough. I can barely tell my skin from all the ash and sweat. When I get back, it's refueling time. And you, Jesse? I don't know. Figure out how I screwed up? <laughs> You're such a kidder. remember the last time I saw a real one. Huh? <sighs> How sweet. When did you get so thoughtful? A guy can change. It has been five years. Huh? I need to talk to Barrett. Right. Come on in. Daddy, the Mongo place blew up. Everyone on TV's talking about it. Don't you worry about all that silliness. Daddy's here and he's not going anywhere tonight. Now turn that thing off and let's get you to bed, huh? Do you mind keeping Marlene company until I'm done with this? Me? Yeah, you. Yeah, yeah, your money. Ask Tifa. She takes care of all that. Hey! What the hell do you think you're doing scaring my daughter like that? Daddy says never talk to strangers. <laughs> That's right, honey. I do say that. What a good girl you are remembering daddy's lessons. <laughs> you know what else good girls do? They go to bed on time. Come on. Tired. I want to talk some more, Daddy. Mm, all right, but just this once. <sighs> uh, so then, what can I get you? My money. I'm still waiting on it. Uh, right. About that. We should talk outside. <sighs> um. Daddy, did the people who died all return to the planet? Of course. Before we get on to money, there's an empty apartment in a place just down the road. It's nothing fancy, but I was thinking you could stay there for now. The landlady's a big friend of the cause, so you wouldn't even have to pay rent. Sound good? Sure does. Thanks. <laughs> Follow me, then. How was it up on the plate? It was... chaotic. Sorry for dragging you into all this. It was, it was wrong of me to put you in danger that like that. News. I promise I won't do it again. Dangerous part of the job. Don't worry about me. I'll try not to. Always happy to help stick it to Shinra. Not good at all. I don't know what it is. So, you make nice with everyone? As much as I could, all things considered. Maybe not enough for them. Good. You had me worried. 
You're not exactly a people person. I'll give you that. I saw Sector 8 on the news. It was like a war zone. The news is just another Shinra mouthpiece. They'll spread whatever Can lies Shinra tells them to. Seven? So, the brought this it wasn't himself. that bad? It was. Oh, right. And here we are. Good old Stargazer Heights. You're on the second floor. Room 201 here is where I sleep. Don't have time for much else, what with 7th Heaven and all. <laughs> Not even time to decorate. Here's your room, 202. Don't worry, I already told the landlady about you. You did? Yes? Oh, I mean I told her I had a friend looking for a place to stay. Was that too much? No. It's fine. And this? That one's, uh... Know what? It's getting late. I'll introduce you tomorrow. It's a little bare, but should be enough to get you through the night. If you want anything else, we can always there get There is it. one thing. My money. You guys owe me 2,000, remember? I do. And we'd love to settle up, especially since this was your first job for us, but... That's it? Sorry. We spent the rest preparing for the mission. That really is it. But not for long. I'm collecting money for filters tomorrow, so I can pay you after. <sighs> and you're sure about that? Of course, as long as you help, that is. Wait, then I'd have to pay you for that, too. Never mind. No, two thousand's enough. That's what we agreed on, so that'll be the price. With what you gave me, that leaves fifteen hundred. You're the best! I'll see you bright and early at the bar, then. Thanks again for everything. Sleep tight. <sighs> Guess it's time for introductions. Hey, you okay in there? Oh. Coming in. But he's not a bad guy. The landlady asked me to check on him now and then to make sure he's okay. Can I ask you to do the same? Sure.
Well now, you must be Cloud. I'm Marl, your landlady. So how'd you like the place? You from up on high? I've been around. I'll bet. No matter. All kinds come through with all kinds of reasons. If you ever need an ear to bend, I'll lend you mine. Can be about anything. Even Tifa. What's she to you? The granddaughter I never had. And if you hurt her, I'll take it out of your hide. You hear me? Loud and clear. Good. Now you'd best get a move on to Seventh Heaven. She's got a head start on you and then some. Nothing to report. Maintaining. My husband decided to go to the city. Just imagine if Rich was Another thing. Everyone's worried there. It's times like this that remember. My sister on the phone. They were sent. My sister on the You were right, boss. It was those avalanche. You won't get the best of me. I hope he's okay. Last I knew he was posted in reactor one. I heard from him since the blue. Morning. Hey. Just so you know, Marlene's still asleep. <laughs> Let's get down to business, shall we? Huh? These water filters won't replace themselves. <laughs> Although the next batch probably could, if Jesse put her mind to it. Most every home in the area has one. Folks love them because they practically eliminate the rotten egg smell. Honestly, they make us more money than this place. And it's easy money, too. We bring new filters, collect the old ones, and get paid. What? <sighs> Give me a break. I'm not a salesman. I'm a soldier. Which is why no one will refuse to pay. What do you say? Uh, Please? Let's get this over with. Great. And while we're at it, I'll give you the grand tour. Go ahead and keep whatever we collect. Seeing as you didn't bring any luggage, I'm guessing there's stuff you need to buy. Thanks. And don't worry, we'll pay you the difference so after. Just Barrett's out making his rounds too. Don't take your eyes as long as I get it all today. Take your time now. you could want straight from the plate no matter your needs or your budget our wide selection hey there here to change out your water filter tifa baby how you doing been waiting for you to wait who's he cloud's in charge of collections he'll take your money sounds like a pretty sweet gig if you ever need someone to fill in i'm your man in your dreams maybe huh cloud uh since we're here, maybe we should do a little shopping. Suppose I could take a look. Market for anything else, drop on by. Especially if Teeth is with you. We'll see you around, okay? 
And let us know when your filter next needs changing. All the items you can want, straight from the place. He's a regular. Stock up here, and he might throw in a freebie or two. For you, maybe. Well, you could try being a little nicer. To get free shit? Not my style. <laughs> Our next stop is Stargazer Heights. Landlady's is a client. Just met her. Then you know what to expect. Remember, she's a good friend of Avalanche, so be nice. Please. Huh? Can't help but take a little pleasure in their panic. More than a little. Apparently it was done by a terrorist group called Avalanche. This is Nothing to report. Maintaining surveillance. Hey, Marl. Got some filters for ya. Tifa! My dear, dear girl! Oh, what's he doing here? You working? Be nice. <laughs> Cloud's helping me with collections. You'd better take care of her. I'm pretty good at taking care of myself, you know. That I do. Still, better him than you. No charm, no wit. Big sword, but no skills. I've got skills. Be nice. I'm doing my best. You're looking awfully glum. Are you getting enough sleep? A good long rest to cure anything, I tell you. A tried and true lesson for life on the ground floor, am I right? That you are. Now, your money. Thanks, Marl. You take care of yourself. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. Marl's great. She helped get me set up back in the day. You been here a while now? Five years, give or take. But never mind that. We've got to get you your money. Last stop is the weapons store. Hey, if it isn't Tifa. You here for the filter? <laughs> That last filter didn't do shit! We're so sorry about that. Hopefully this one will work better. Save your excuses and get out! Alright. If you could just settle your bill, we'll be on our way. The hell? You charging me for your busted ass goods? My associate handles payment disputes. Think you can mosey up in here and have it your way? Pretty please. <laughs> Thank you very much. Seeing as we're done with our rounds and you've got a small fortune now, why not take a gander at the weapons? Well, when will Barrett be back with the rest? <sighs> Before we open up tonight. It'll be a while yet, so... What do you want to do? Don't really know. In that case, I've got a suggestion. Want to hear it? If you're serious about becoming a merc, then you're going to need to start making connections. It's not what you know, but who you know, you know? Hmm. Another lesson for life on the ground floor? Yep. Connections get you jobs. Jobs build your rep. And more rep gets you better connections. How do I start? Hmm. Why not help out the Neighborhood Watch? They're mostly volunteers, but you'll get to know people. Yeah, okay. Didn't see anybody at the office, so let's head up top. No better way to keep you and your family safe than with a weapon of your own. Come and check out our selection. We gotta do something about the monsters on Scrap Boulevard. I'll head on down there first thing tomorrow. Not alone, you won't. Huh. Didn't know you were holding down the fort. Huh? Oh, uh, hey, Cloud. Looking to join the Neighborhood Watch? That depends. What does this Neighborhood Watch do? Uh, lots of stuff, really. But our top priority is taking care of any beasts that wander into town. That, and teaching the locals how to defend themselves. Like they say, the only one who will look out for you is you. Cloud's a great fighter, but only we know that. If no one knows him, no one will hire him. Thought if he joined the Watch, he could get his name out there. That would work for everybody! Truth be told, we could really use your help. We can't pay you in kill, but we'll work something out. For example... Aha! What about your sword? I could mod it for you. No thanks. 
It's fine just the way it is. What? You some kind of purist? I know I'd never pass up a chance to improve my gear. Come on. At least let me show you how it's done. All set? Needless to say, you'll have to try it out to appreciate the difference. Thanks. Huh. <laughs> we'll do you one better. Spread the word to everyone who'll listen about the new Mercantown. Between him and Wedge, there isn't anyone they don't know. I'll march through the streets singing your praises, even on an empty stomach. So, where are these monsters? Scrap Boulevard. Good hunting. Hey, Cloud. I'll come with. No. I've got this. But you don't know the way, do you? We don't. <laughs> sure thing. I know these streets better than anyone. Oh Scrap Boulevard is out west. Past the barricades, supposed to keep the monsters out. Anyway, we should prepare, just in case. Searching for candidates. If any harm comes to her. Here's Scrap Boulevard. I can see why monsters would feel right at home. And the more we pile up, the more they show up. That's what a soldier looks like in action. This was just a warm-up. <laughs> I'll bet. Let's keep at it. Going in. Be the last of them. They won't stay gone for long. Of course not. Even so, folks will be grateful for the peace and quiet in the meantime. A win's a win, you know? True. Trust me, it'll do wonders for your rep. Right. Let's go check in with Biggs and Wedge.
Doesn't look like a merc. That sword's massive. Searching for candidates. I hear you, so. Got new numbers for Monster Slaying this month. Check them out. You hear someone got rid of all the monsters on Back already? Got every last one, too. Now the slum should be safe. You guys are machines! Good job. Meanwhile, we told everyone we could about you. So I heard. I've gotta ask, though. What did you tell them? It's all right. All you gotta do is keep up the good work. It'll pay off soon enough, I promise. How's the sword, by the way? Good. Glad to hear it. Seems like the perfect fit for you. Yeah. We've been through a lot. Oh. You okay? I'm fine. Been meaning to ask. After you left the village... It's a long story. I've got time. Why don't you tell me all about it while we try to wrestle up some more work for you? That sounds great! I'll come too! Oh, uh, no you won't. What? Run along now, you two. Uh, Sorry, go on. maybe uh. next time. Huh? No fair! Uh, think about it for a second. They haven't seen each other in years. You'd be a third wheel. Uh, uh. Hey, before we get back to it, why don't you check out the weapons? No need. Come on, the dealer's probably heard all about you by now. Might treat you better. I don't know about that. You hear someone got rid of all the monsters on scrap bullets? You know, there's a hole in the break room roof. That's that mercenary guy. Hold up. Heard there's a merc that'll take on any monster. You the man? Word spreads fast around here. What if I am? Sorry about before. I get antsy when business is slow. <sighs> Man in your line of work needs weapons, no? Why not try that one on for size? Yours on the house. Badass like you rocking my weapons is good advertising. Think about it. Fine. Or if you want to take a look at something else. Just a look. Don't be a stranger. Since you've got yourself a new weapon, let's see if we can't put it to good use. Come on, let's go chat up Weimer. Who? The guy who tracks all the requests that come to the watch. You never know, could toss some work your way. Where's he at? Oh, he should be back at the office by now. Searching for candidates. Uh, hey there, Tifa. You need a helping hand? Actually, I wanted to introduce you to an old friend of mine. This is Cloud. He's a merc. Ah, you don't say. Well, we're always on the lookout for experienced fighters to help us deal with the bigger critters. I'll take on anything. For the right price, that is. Experienced and cocky, huh? If it's a challenge you want, I might have a few good ones. Your clients can fill you in on the details. Prove yourself with these jobs, and I'll see if I can't find you some more. Thanks. Candidate detected. Performing physical analysis. Sizable weapon. Excellent cardiovascular health and impressive lung capacity. Perfectly balanced muscle and bone structure. An optimal candidate! My name is Chadley. I'm an intern for Shinra's Research and Development Division. I hope you'll be interested in helping me with my research. 
Please accept this as a down payment. I would like you to set that assessed materia in your equipment and use it to gather intelligence in battle. This data will help me to develop new types of materia. I'm not interested in working for Shinra. You should know that I work actively to undermine Shinra's efforts. I'm sure you of all people can appreciate the tremendous power of materia, as well as how it might be wielded against your corporate enemies. And if you later decide that I am not worthy of your trust, you can do what you do best. I will hold you to that. Excellent! Then we shall work together so long as you deem fit. Once you've completed your task, please return and report to me. something about the Doom Rats? Them and their were-rat buddies have been tearing up town looking for food and whatnot. Got into the store and made one hell of a mess, let me tell you. <laughs> oh, you think that's funny, do you? Don't I. I saw you crack a smile. Well, do the job and you can laugh it up for all I care. Anyway, they're probably nesting in the outskirts. Now I've heard a were-rat in pain will call its friends for help. And the whole rat pack will come running just like that. All the items you can want, straight from the plate. Another day. A friend of Steve's. Give or take. Sir. around hmm. what do you think should we wait you know this might be a waste of time let's head back to the store and touch base for now I've heard so much about. You're not here to shop, are you? People were right. You look like you can handle yourself. So some drakes have made themselves at home in the abandoned Talager factory. Can't have that kind of trouble around here. My regulars will do anything to get their hands on the scrap in there, and if they run into those drakes, they could get hurt. I'll handle it. Much obliged, sir. Head on over to the old Talager factory and talk to Narjan. He's the watchman guarding the entrance. Good luck. I'm counting on you, my friend. Narjan's the one with all the details. You'll find him outside the old Talager factory. Don't forget to stock up before you go. Shops on Culvert Street. Stock goods you won't find in the red Chinese not a bad My sister. 
So this is all. Step back. Factory's off limits. Drakes have been spotted inside. Huh? Wait a minute. Tifa? Don't tell me you're here to take care of those things. Are you? In that case, be my guest. We believe there's at least two groups lurking somewhere inside the factory. Find and cull them all. You're dead. Don't hold back. You got it. You're done. It's on now. Let's finish this. That's a win. Locked up tight. Got rid of those drakes in the factory, did ya? What a relief. I can't wait to give my regulars the good news. You're the real deal, all right. Keep it up, and I can see you going far as a merc in this town. I've worked with my fair share over the years, so believe me when I say that I know what I'm talking about. Anyway, you're needed over at the pillar. Apparently another flying bastard stirring up trouble. Bet you can't get enough of this, huh? Well... No, I get it. If you're good at something, might as well make it your living. May not know you, but I know a man who's found his calling when I see one. Keep at it. I switch out my stock every so often, so drop by when you're in the neighborhood, huh? That went well. Could be you found your calling. Eh. Was all right, I guess. Think of each job as an opportunity. Not to make money, but to build connections. It's not what you know, but who. <laughs> you remembered. Not a patient teacher. <laughs> Maybe not so patient next time. 
Oh boy. <laughs> oh, Barrett should have finished collecting his share of the money by now. So what do you want to do? Head back to the bar? Go. Finally managed to get those doom rats, huh? Thanks, guys. You're the greatest. I was so dead in here, I thought I might have to close up shop for good. Hey, got an idea. Hear me out. If the guy who took care of the town's rat problem told everybody where he liked to shop... Well... What do you say? I'll make it worth your while, of course. Give you some incentive. Talk you up to Weimer and my customers, and anybody else who listen. You'll be swimming in work before you know it! Yeah, sure. <laughs> okay then, that's what I like to hear. Seventh Heaven, the new Merc in town in my little store. I can see it now. We're gonna clean up! <laughs> <laughs> 